and uh, yeah here we are so at this place and um, going to visit the Mazu temple should be pretty cool and there is the sea so you can smell the sea here beautiful autumn weather and yeah it's lovely it's really beautiful looking forward to seeing the ocean seeing the sea seeing the Bohai Sea big uh, big Didi ride to get here about 65 70 minutes and um, yeah nice car brand new car but uh, you just get sick of sitting in a car obviously everybody does looks like a solar solar art installation there and um, yes yeah, cool it reminds me of some places on the New South Wales coast feels um feels like I'm in Australia yeah it feels reminds me of a, of a section near Wollongong actually yeah it's quite interesting it's just really really reminiscent there's my mates and um, yeah all right there's the sea pretty keen to get to the sea now yeah so these guys are you know they're having fun taking lots of photos they they love that little place but um yeah what they what they don't realize is that the sea is i just couldn't wait i had to go and see the actual sea the sea cool little bike there you can use the sea is just here you know this is the sea and um they've got this got this pretty serious um sea wall here and it goes all the way along here it's not very pretty and obviously there's no direct access to the sea from here which is a bit a bit annoying i would have liked to have put my hands in it or something like that but but yeah there are little there are little fishes i don't know whether this iphone camera is picking it up but yeah there's little fishes there which is cool and then on the horizon there are there are fishing boats probably well you know who knows how far they are away probably over a mile a little bit over a mile and um yeah this is the sea this is really the sea and um yeah if you thought the crackdown on um on extra work was bad enough or you thought the crackdown on um on other things was pretty bad you know like check out this there's a ban on the sea the sea is also banned but uh yeah like um what is that i know the first one is gin gin it's like gin it's like um forbidden and uh yeah i guess uh, ginger yeah, yeah, yeah. uh xia hai so yeah forbidden to go down to the sea so um yeah the chinese is pretty clear but the english is pretty funny ban on the sea it looks pretty funny yeah. the other ones say no climbing this one's the only one that says ban on the sea so. and these guys are trying to get to me but they're having trouble yeah they they, gotta, they do get lost you know they do get lost but it's probably my fault i'm a bit impatient so i just went ahead but a bit confused now so I'd better better go and help them out pretty cute yeah my mother-in-law was just calling that a duck in Chinese so she doesn't she doesn't know the know the word in, in uh, Chinese for seagull so she was just calling it a duck so that's pretty funny uh, but um, and then she thought maybe they weren't real <laughs> so yeah quite funny quite uh, quite beautiful carved reliefs there.
Yeah, so this is the statue of Mazu, and um, I guess you could compare compare her to Athena. She's like a, a god of a, a, a very important god for, for for this city. I guess maybe yeah, maybe not Athena. Was Athena a god of the sea? I forget. <laughs> but um, yeah, she's like she's like a very important, I guess, kind of deity for the local people. So they're offering. They're offering like burning incense for her and stuff, which um, to me obviously seems a little bit ridiculous. But you know, this is their culture, and uh, yeah, I mean, you're not going to get very far in China by making fun of Mazu, especially around these coastal areas. So yeah, there she is. There she is. And yeah, it is very windy, but. Over there, you can see the uh, you can see the the roof. That's the building that houses the Maritime Museum, and um, you can also see that contrary to some people's belief, uh, the Chinese are very, very, very busy continuing to build their own country. And um, yeah, you can see around here that the work is very, very far from complete, but. It's just still really cool that such an amazing, such an amazing place is um, is open. And when it's completely finished, this whole cultural district is finished. It's going to be, it's going to be really amazing. Um, it's cool. It's great. I love it.